Uchiha. That was loud in my ear. Happy first. Um. I, I'm not starting officially yet because OBS is freaking out and I don't know why. Um, so I'm just letting it sit for a second. It's at 20% CPU, and I don't know why. I tried fixing it today. I've been working on this shit for hours. I gave up like half an hour ago. But how are you today? <laughs> I hope you're doing well, Uchiha, and anyone else who may come in or might be here that I'm not aware of. I forgot to turn the vibration off on my phone and the sound. I'm just gonna look at my task. I got rid of a ton of shit on my OBS. And, um, it seemed like it had helped, but it's back to its bullshit again. Hi, Whitney. How are you? What are you up to? Are you at work too? I am stuck at work, so it's okay. Yuck. I'm sorry. Sorry you're stuck at work. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Um. Yep, at work. How is work for you today, Whitney? I've never seen it sit this high before. Right now it's sitting at 25%. I'm not sure what's causing it. It's going slow. Oh no. <laughs> Have you been playing games with anyone at work today? Little like like pretend basketball or something. I'm gonna attempt the main quest since we're only two levels beneath it. I don't know what I'm doing today. Hi Exo, thanks for lurking. I appreciate it. I'm gonna watch the new James Bond after work though with a friend. There's a new James Bond coming out? I didn't even know that. I hope you have fun. That sounds like it would be fun. It sure heckin' sounds like it would be fun. <laughs> Heck yeah. I Would y'all kill me if I said I've never seen a James Bond movie? Because it's true. I've never seen one before. Hey Anna, how are you? Negative. <laughs> Why not? Have y'all seen that office game of um, people setting up fans and like having a, what's it called? It's, it's like a paper airplane and it's like floating around because of the fans. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh, great stream. Love you all. Thank you. I appreciate it. I hope you do as well. Didn't know that, but didn't know they're making another Halloween. I didn't think. Watch James Bond. Gotcha. They're making another Halloween? That would be cool. I know they just came out with um, that new Candyman, which a friend of mine said was good. I haven't seen the original or the new one. My AC is so loud when it turns on. Not in the house, but outside the house. It gets loud. I'm seeing if my Discord is going to do the live announcement. Slowly, you're slowly beating your game. Finishing it today. Nice. I don't know what those number means. Numbers mean. Words are hard, but I'm excited for you. That's heckin' cool. I need to buy more chapstick, y'all. <laughs> I am personally tired of remakes. Like at this point, I'm not excited about movies anymore. Oh no, that makes me sad. You don't, there's not any remakes that you've enjoyed yet? Or recently, I guess is a better, I mean, I guess that's fair. I, I do feel like it can ruin some of the nostalgia for a lot of people. Is drawing me to her. Can you guys hear the game okay? 
It came out. It comes out next week. I want to watch Halloween and Candyman gave me nightmares. Candyland gave me nightmares? Candyland? Candyman? I can't. Words are hard. Um, yeah, so you're going to have like a whole heckin' Halloween session. That's cool. Oh, the numbers me chapter and level got it. Well, I'm excited for you. No worries. You enjoy your lurk. Thanks for popping in. I appreciate it. You just want original stories? I, I get that. I get that. I I think that um part of me I'm not like excited for for remakes, but like part of me understands why there would be instead of lots of original stuff, just because I think that these last two years, 2020 and 2021, have really wiped people out. Um, so, but then again, I'm not normal and I don't usually watch movies much, so I feel like my opinion doesn't matter because I don't watch anyway. So, you know. Look at these cute little goats. I like their horns. Oh, I discovered a new region. Look, yeah. Look at that. The links are working. The links are working. Nice. I plan on making another um, uh, Theodore emote. I'm thinking of doing a Halloween version, like maybe as a wizard or something. I don't know. Sorry if this spoon is loud against the mic. Hi, Killer. How are you? The lurking wife wants to do stuff and things. No worries. Thanks for coming in. I appreciate it. I hope you're having a good day. I saw in Flamestream about um, your interview thing. Congrats. That's exciting. You don't have to respond, but I wanted to congratulate you because I was listening in on his stream. Uh, enjoyed this game so much. Bought it on mobile long ago and beat it more than five times. That sounds like me and Stardew Valley. <laughs> I think there are original movies coming out, but they get so overshadowed by the remakes that I don't even know about them. That's that's also fair. Uh, remake has been a trend for at least the past five years. Has it really been going on that long? For real? Dang, I don't even think I've watched any remakes, at least recently. I know that like Lion King was one of them. I haven't seen that yet. It's the only one I can think of, obviously Candyman, but I never watched the original. I don't know. I don't have a lot of... I don't have a lot of inputs. So what other remakes are coming out besides James Bond? Well, no, that's not a remake. Um, besides Candyman and stuff. I keep almost saying Candyland, and I'm going to be honest. It's because um, whenever Cobalt and I leave anywhere, I put on the movie Django. Django Unchained, which is a phenomenal movie, by the way, and Django is fucking cool as hell, the character. Um, and uh, I, so because I hear that movie a lot, since I play it when we leave for Larry to have noise, um, I hear the term Candyland a lot, which is not a good place, but I just, my brain, you know. That was a lot of words. I feel like it's only gotten worse. Really? Nothing wrong with me, but I forgot God. I can't talk. Do we need another? Are they making another Cinderella? Are they really? Like legit? Oh, I know what you're talking about. It's with that one singer lady, isn't it? It's too hot. I mean, actually, that might not be too hot. Okay, cool. My Discord worked. Scream 5? There's- I didn't even know there was four screams. I thought there was only one. <laughs> There's five of them? How the hell did they stretch that story out? Wow. Well, that's exciting. That's heckin' exciting. Heck yeah, man. I need- I'm just gonna- mark that quest so that I can go to the thing. I don't I don't actually know if I've ever seen the original Scream either now that I think about it. <laughs> I suck. I'm terrible. 
I'm always like, I like horror movies, and then I'm like, I haven't seen this, or this, or this, or this. Are you gonna watch all of those in the movie theaters, Uchiha? I miss going to the movies. I love doing movie theater stuff. There's just something about sitting in a large room in the dark, eating popcorn and drinking soda, and watching hopefully a good movie. <laughs> With that heckin' surround sound. And I know you can basically replicate that in your house, but it's not the same. It's not the same, because you're not leaving your house. I refuse. I refuse. The child saw me, oh no. Is synchronizing a quest? Is the synchronization part of a quest? Look at how big this city is, dang. There's an arena over there. Oh. This is a quest. Oh, Flavius. My glasses are dirty. What movies are you into besides Lord of the Rings and Harry Potter? I wouldn't know what to tell you, to be honest. Um, when I was a kid, I was obsessed with the movie Congo and the movie From Dusk Till Dawn, which is definitely not for kids. Um, I love the Tinkerbell movies. I've seen every single Tinkerbell movie a lot. I love them, and I watch them very easily. I don't know what it is about them, but I watch them very easily. Um, I've, I really like The Descent. That movie freaks me out because I don't like going underground. That's a good one. Um, that's all I can think of right now. Django Unchained, again, is really good. I like that a lot. Uh, As Above, So Below is one of my favorite movies just because of its um, nature and alchemy. That's all I can think of right now. I see more comments, but I'm cleaning my glasses. Pardon me, friends. Pardon me? I hope OBS is behaving. I don't know if y'all saw that picture I posted in Discord of my OBS shitting on my computer, but it was bad. Hi, Abby. Thanks for the sippy. I appreciate it. Got my water. Hello. Thank you. I was like, is it really not going to work? Hello. Hello. The sound alerts might be loud. If they're too loud, let me know and I can fix it. Um, I love going to the movies, love popcorn and soda. And when I'm not feeling good, that's my place to go. Yeah, right? It's cozy. It's very comfy. Oh, you've seen From Dust Till Dawn? A lot of people I know, and Congo, a lot of people I know have never seen those two. They're good movies. I love Congo. The book was not great, if I'm honest. But the movie is fantastic. The Descent. Have you seen the second one? It definitely wasn't as good as the first one, I think. But I thought it was cool that they kind of like wrapped it up somehow. Yay, it's working. Thank you, Abby. And the links work. Yeah, I think I managed to fix, mo fix most things. Um, except for my CPU issue with my computer. But, uh, yeah. Amy, good gorilla. She is a good gorilla. <laughs> I love her. The book was kind of meh because they, um, the author, the author who is the same author of the Jurassic Park books, um, he wrote Congo which the movie was based off of, and, and I just struggled with it because it was nothing but, like, use, useless science talk. And, like, it just... It was too much. Like, I, I don't know. It, it didn't... And, and the characters, I couldn't connect with any of the characters. Even Amy. I love Amy, and I couldn't connect with Amy. They, they portrayed her to be this, like, pubic... pubic... Like, going through puberty brat. <laughs> it was horrible. Your browser died. Oh no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
There are good movies. It cracks me up when that guy eats the cake. <laughs> Stop eating my sesame cake! <laughs> Do I need to talk to this kid? I guess. That was the greatest thing I ever witnessed. And I once saw a snake swallow a cat whole. A cat? Really? And who are you? Ethiopes. But all my friends call me Ethio. Well, Ezio. Is he Greek? I, How did you do that? Are you magic? Will you leave some more for me and my friends? I can tell you about my home, the most amazing city of Cyrene as we go. How can I refuse such a gracious uh, Apparently I'm gonna follow this way. child into wherever. Descent 2 is okay, but I'm glad it wrapped it up. Yeah, see, I, I feel the same way. Also, the guy in the Descent 2 that like not the not the caver not the guy that leads the caving expedition but the the like deputy dude he pisses me off hi mama sita how are you how's it going still interesting though yeah <laughs> same 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 hi king how are you i think the gpu in this computer is dying i think mine's struggling too if I'm honest. It was a nightmare today. Hello, Fizz Streamer. How are you doing today on this wonderful day of days of wonderfulness? <laughs> I am doing all right, King. How are you today? How was everyone yesterday? I missed you all. Looks like everything is working. I mean, knock on wood, that I know of, it's working. Um, it's still reading really high on my CPU. It says it's 20% right now. <laughs> it is what it is. How are you? How did your your volunteer meeting go? I can see that, Ezio. Let's go to the baths. Oh God! It's where people walk around naked, being scraped and scratched and rubbed with oil. I hate getting my hair wet. Don't you, Bayek? Ah, uh, yes. That's hilarious, because I have him with hair. Well, anyway, he spent 10,000 drachma on a floor made of little squares. All of that for some way you wash. When I grow up, I'm going to have a wife who'll never make me wash. Wives like that are hard to find, Desio. <laughs> where? Did you jump from up there? Up where? That's a death sentence. The top of the baths? I could do that with my eyes. Up there? Come on, everyone. Come see Bayek fly. No one. I'm so confused. <laughs> They're very good. They're very good. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad. The guy in the cave was annoying, and when he was talking loud on the radio, also, I I don't like Juno. I'm gonna be honest. I I don't like Juno. I don't think she deserved what happened to her and neither did anyone for that matter but um yeah i didn't like to know <laughs> that guy was an idiot though just sitting for a moment before i get back up that's a mood where what are you else what where's her heart what else are you gonna do today even though juno is back sammy your friend's still my favorite that's a loaded sentence, my guy. <laughs> That's funny. I mean, I wouldn't say she was backstabbing her friends. She was straight up having an affair with one of her friend's husbands. It's a little more than backstabbing. Just a little bit. That high, can they? Am I supposed to jump up there? Your meeting was interesting? Did it, was it okay? Is, is good interesting or bad interesting? See? Didn't I tell you he was brave? Okay. Oh my days! <laughs> They're so cute! I wasn't sure myself, as you. This little kid is really You're cute. Egyptian, right? My father says you don't worship the same gods as we Greeks. 
We have some in common, like Serapis. Hey, Bayek, we haven't finished the tour. Bayek, you're back. You ready for your next jump? Yes. Where go? Who? I need to actually follow the quest because. Oh, what? Probably we'll have to run back out to figure out dinner situation. It's on the good side. Well, that's good. You gonna order dinner tonight? What are what are your options? Where? Oh, I that's I was talking to the wrong child. My bad. You're back. You ready for your next jump? Yes. Oh yeah, Serapis. I've heard of him. Apollo is all Greek and my favorite. He likes poetry, music, wine, and all that kind of stuff. But I like him because he has a bow and arrow, and he likes to hunt. Do you like to hunt, Bayek? I do. I used to hunt with my boy, Ezio. If you jump from his temple there, then maybe he'll be watching from Mount Olympus and reward me with my own bow and arrow so I can hunt rabbits in the woods. I would like to see that. Yeah, this little boy is so cute. Isn't the polo marvelous? I'm concerned. Why is this called the Flea of Cyrene? Are these kids gonna die? I, I'm just, I'm very concerned because this game does not shy away from the death. From the die. We're all watching! I can't watch! Tell me when it's over! He's so brave! Have you ever seen someone so brave? And I'm the one who found him! I know, Ezio! One, one second. Make the polo proud, Bayek! So, I didn't like Juno, mainly because of the affair stuff. Because, like, that's fucked up. Um, and I also really didn't like... It's just stupid to... go into a cave with, like, with a group of people that are, like, they're obvious, they made it clear that, like, this group of women were experienced in doing caving of some sort, but, like, they were going into this, this structure that they knew nothing about, and she was playing it off as if it was this very safe outing, and it was just really, really stupid. Like, she's a fucking idiot. I don't care, like, she sucks. So, I really don't like Juno. She was very strong, she was a very good fighter, and I still, you know, don't think she deserved what she got happening to her in any capacity, but she's a fucking idiot. <laughs> and she absolutely got her friends killed, because she's stupid. So, that's, that's, that's how I feel about Juno in fucking The Descent. <laughs> Poetry, music, and wine, and all that stuff. Apollo's great. He's a great god. Not sure if ordering or if I'll have to run to the store. Gotcha. What What would you possibly cook tonight for dinner? We had spaghetti last night, and it did not go well for me. I'm still not feeling great from it because I don't have a gallbladder, and ever since I got my gallbladder out, tomato products hate me. <laughs> What fucking day is it? I always struggle with it. It's Thursday. Thursday. It's Thursday. You have to give her some credit. Nobody knew they were monsters. I, no, but it's not even about the monsters. It's it's the fact that that cave system, like, there was, there was no way for anyone to come rescue them because it's an unnamed system. And, like, that in itself is you're endangering your friends for clout. Come on. That's shitty. That's really fucking shitty. It's just, I don't like it. <laughs> Did you see how easily that tunnel system collapsed while they were in there? They hadn't even run into the monsters yet. Sorry if this is spoilers for the movie The, the Descent. She wanted to just, I don't care. She endangered her- that's not how you discover things. She had no rescue plan in place. 
She had no way to help anyone if anything happened. And she, she tricked everyone. And that's another thing, too. If everyone was in on it, I think it, it that would have changed my mind a little bit. <laughs> Just a little bit. Because at least then everyone would be like, okay, we need to be cautious. This place has never been found before. Like, we, you know, we can't just go willy-nilly into this cave system. You know what? No, she's, you're not going to change my mind on this. She's an idiot. She's a fucking idiot. And it, 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 I don't care. <laughs> what are we talking about? We're talking about the movie The Descent. Have you seen it before, Mama Sita? My shirt is doing weird things. I'm just on her side. No, you, you're on her side for why? Why are you on her side? Talk to me, Uchiha. Talk to me. Give me, give me your reasoning. That's for any tunnel, though. No, it's. Be <laughs> My nose is just. Charted an expedition to a completely different cave, then went to explore an unexplored cave. Yeah. It, yep. <laughs> yep. It was not geologically the kind of cave one would go caving in. Exactly, yeah. Sounds familiar. Uh, it's really good, actually. It's on Amazon Prime right now. Um, I don't know if it's on anything else, but I know for a fact it's on Amazon Prime because I had it playing recently. Um, but basically this group of women goes caving and it goes horribly wrong. <laughs> Horribly wrong. Yeet. Now where is this kid gonna take me? Look at all the kids! They had a map with routes and shit for the one they charted, and then they go to a cave that isn't safe slash chart. Exactly! Exactly! And it's not even, like, Juno, she, I wanted us all to discover it. No, you wanted to save your ass because you had an affair with your friend's husband, you fucker. That's really what it was about. And they made it pretty clear in the movie. I'm so salty. I'm in a mood, you guys, because I don't feel good mentally and physically. So if I get extra bitey, please don't take it personally. I love you all. <laughs> I'm just like... They did. They did make a second one. Um, I don't know if that one's on any platforms right now to watch. It might be. I noticed that it flips between Amazon Prime and Hulu a lot. That particular movie. Well, th those two movies. There's a movie called The Cave that I want to watch that's on Netflix. If I can get myself to focus on it. Because I'm pretty sure I've seen it before years ago i'm gonna see if cobalt will watch it with me i saw the foreign version before it came to america america land america land uh, and it had a better ending but they're very similar there's a foreign version is there really i didn't know that by do you mean giving us the sass <laughs> it is the sass it is the sass I'm also really tired. I'm like a I'm like a toddler that needs to go down for a nap but refuses. There had to be a bad guy. <laughs> That's fair, Uchiha. I'll give you that. That's fair. Ow. Don't get me wrong. I I uh, still like I said I think Juno is definitely very strong. Um, and she's she's smart. She's just like the way she went about stuff and the reasons were just ridiculous like Not worth it. My hand. It feels like I got bit by something right here. It's very itchy We just watched it again. Yes, same the cave. Oh the descent wait You just watched the descent or the cave. How do you like the cave? I'm pretty sure I've seen it. I just don't I, I don't know but if I did see it, it was years ago, like 10 years ago. 
But you look like you can handle a few measly bucket heads. Are you ready, Bayek? Oh god. Oh god. Don't let the Romans see you. Fuck. You're a mother of God. It's too high. Go on, jump, Bayek. Jump from the top of the tower. I don't want to sneak. They keep a kraken. Sure. <laughs> Why do they want me to do this? I don't want to be seen in the window. I almost was. Alright. Uh oh! No, don't get down. Climb up. I saw the cave years ago as well. Yes, we rewatched it. it has nothing on the descent though. Yeah, the descent is really good. That's fair. I'm excited to watch it. I hope Cobalt watches it with me. Have any of y'all I was talking to Zed this morning. Zed dead, not Zed Wilder. Um and we were talking about because I asked if he had seen the new conjuring movie yet, the um I think it's called The Devil Made Me Do It. That's another one I want to watch because those movies are really cheesy, but I enjoy them. And, uh, have any of y'all seen it? Stop crowding him. Stop crowding. He's not your slave. He's an important man with important things to do. Stay well, Bayek. Come back when I'm older. And we'll get married. Oh my god. Do you think with practice we could yeah, live like that? Sure. Sure. <laughs> Why not? To get this day, Bayek. We should honor it. I officially name you the Flea of Cyrene. <laughs> I will treasure it. Goodbye, Ezio. Stay out of trouble. I'm a flea. I'm, I'm a flea. You, but I will try for you, great flea. I hope you get to hunt with your son again soon. <laughs> he calls me the great flea. I love that. Damn. Got 2200 XP just for leaping off of shit. Fuck yeah. Hail year. Is there another thing to do synchronization? There's one over here. Should I go do that first or should I try the main quest? Hmm. I'm gonna go unlock this. I've been pretty easy going with Assassin's Creed lately. Oh, that's right. Wasn't it on... Uh, you told me you had it on something, Mamacita. I don't remember what program it was. HBO, maybe? It was interesting. How... Was it any different from the first two? Like, was there, like, possession and, sh and shit like that? Or, um... Cause that's the best part, is the possession. Do y'all prefer paranormal horror movies or slasher horror movies? Good God, that was a fall drop. Long drop. Uh oh. I'm in restricted area, or I was. Not anymore, I guess. Is this restricted? Hello. Oh. Nothing. Not a. How do I call my horse? Is that it? Hi, Soleil. It's been a long time, you, you precious bean. Whoa. You prefer paranormal? Me too. <laughs> HBO Max, that's it. That's it. I was thinking it was HBO. Wasn't sure though. I don't do well with um, like home invasion type stuff or kidnappy type stuff because that's scary. I don't get like scared watching those kinds of movies, but it makes me uncomfortable because then I'm like, because that happens in real life. You know what I mean? <laughs> I don't like it. I can't deal with possession. Penny Dreadful was way too intense for me. Penny Dreadful? The the TV show? I right on Netflix? I haven't seen it, but I've seen that name and heard of it before. 
Is that what that show's about? Apollonia. Apollonia, man. Listen to that fun music. Religious horror is a fun genre. I agree. It, they get so intense with it. The blood of Jesus will drive you out, foul demon. Hmm, yes. Please save my boy. She's not a criminal. Will not I, I will I will help your son, ma'am, but I gotta get to my place first. Uh-oh. They were gonna attack me. There was some possession? Oh no. Is it boring? That makes it seem boring. Loved Penny Dreadful, the first one. Haven't watched the City of Angels one. Oh. Are they movies? That's fair. I feel like not even noticing the effed up stuff in these shows is a superpower. <laughs> it's true. It's true. I need to fix my legs. I'm sweating. The prison, you ran that boy over. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I do fine watching horror stuff, but if it's something that could possibly happen in real life or like ha no 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 um it happens a lot Whoa. like you know the serial killer shit then i'm like that that's unsettling not scary but it's like oh god uh oh no you didn't see nothing yeet <laughs> they were gonna attack me the nun. <laughs> I liked the nun. They did a really good job with it. It was just the chanting. I also don't like chanting and like... Why do these people almost always run me over in boats? Um, chanting in like, in like temples. Um, like, like Buddhist chanting or like with monks and shit also freaks me out. I don't like it. I don't know what it is. If it, if it sounds holy... I don't like it. It unsettles me. I don't know why. I really don't know why, because you'd think it'd be the opposite, right? Like, it's holy chanting, it's safe, you're pretty- whatever. Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit. I don't believe that for a second. I don't believe that for a second. Alright. Get- get off, thanks. Gotta get this. Got- gotta get this. There you go. From the lighthouse. Nelson! <laughs> Nelson! I have in fact seen that one. It's so good! I just really like- what I liked about The Nun was how they tied it together with the, the conjuring stuff, which I won't say more than that in case people haven't seen it, but it's cool as heck. I'm gonna fast travel. I have a thick skin. I tend to watch everything by myself and at night these days, so I have grown hard to fit. Yeah, same. <laughs> I used to fall asleep, well, not used to as in like I stopped or grew out of it or something, but um, I always fall asleep with, with a movie on repeat, like a DVD. Um, and for many months, I was going to bed to 13 ghosts. <laughs> Uh, where am I going? I lost my train of thought. Here, we gotta go here. I don't know why I put a marker there. I didn't mean to. Religion has never made me feel safe ever. Same! <laughs> like, seriously, same. I forgot that they tie together. Yeah! There's like a whole Conjuring universe. I think a bunch of movies are part of the Conjuring universe. I can't remember what the- it's- I can't remember what they call it, but, um, like, like, La Llorona, I think, is part of it, and so is the Annabelle movies, The Nun, The Conjuring, obviously. Whoops. <laughs> Wait, can I upgrade anything? <gasps> yes, I can. Fuck yeah. 
Mm. I've been watching Merlin over and over to fall asleep. The TV show, that old TV show, she's like, you gave him love, I gave him toys. Wait, <laughs> flip that. I gave him love, you gave him toys. I've only seen that one part and I don't know why. <laughs> Is this the main, this one? All right, yeet. Smack right in there. The TV show. I think it's the same one I'm thinking of. It had Helena Bonham Carter. Or am I thinking of something else? I haven't, like I said, I've only literally seen that one part, and I think it was something to do with YouTube. I'm gonna go see. Oh god. What it? I don't even remember what I was doing in the main quest. I know that we were like basically betrayed. So, but that's all I remember. Oh, well then maybe it is a different thing. I have no idea. I have no idea. My camera looks like it's kind of laggy. That's fascinating. Shiloh looks really cute. I want to finish Peaky Blinders. Cobalt's been watching that. Or he was, and then he stopped because he got out of the TV watching mood. And I was like watching slash listening with him, and I'm like, I want more. <laughs> I want more. If y'all haven't seen Peaky Blinders, you should watch it. With a crook up his arse. Demanded my taxes for the year. They burned my farm when I refused. And you are sure it was Leander's men? My wife said no good would come of defying him. I hate it when she's right. <laughs> pay. You have my word. Your word, Diocles? Will not sow my scorched fields. Bring my goats back to life. I am Hi. done with you. End this land. Your word. <laughs> and how has our most venerated magistrate extorted you, Egyptian? Praxila said you could help me. That's I'm a by. big ring. <laughs> Good God. What happening? What happening? I want more chai. I'm gonna drink some water though. Oh, speaking of chai, I have a story to tell y'all once I'm out of a cutscene, because I don't want it to get interrupted. The cutscene, not my story. Right. As well as anyone can be with Flavius desecrating your land. I followed that fucker's murderous trail all the way from Siwa. <laughs> So the rumors? True. As are his preparations for war. One more oppressor. Egypt will never be stable again. Invasions upon invasions. Flavius will make of Egypt one giant tomb. He rules from the Acropolis, but is crawling with Romans. I pray the dice fall in your favor, Bayek. I must deal with this lapdog, the magistrate Leander. Seek me out again, if you would be a friend to Cyrene. Thank you, Diocles. It is time for my son to enter the field of reeds. Fuck yeah, let's do it. Hi, Sad, how are you? Thanks for lurking, I appreciate it. You're the best. Story time and chai? Story time about chai? <laughs> well, I drank all my chai. It's all gone because I've been drinking it like crazy today. All gone. Um. You read the the powder on oh, anyway um story time about chai so i i ran out of chai and ordered more um and it was supposed to come on monday but then during my stream that day they were like oh sorry something went wrong it's gonna be late and i was like okay cool and then they sent me another thing and they were like we can't deliver this you're gonna get refunded though basically and I was like what the fuck <laughs> so I ordered a different kind because so I was like I have to have my chai so I ordered a different kind um and that came just fine but then today all of a sudden I get a notification and they're like your order is out for delivery and I was like what order like I don't what I didn't order anything else 
And it's the fucking original chai that they said that they couldn't deliver and that they said was going to get refunded to me. So I don't know. Now I have two bags of chai, which is fine. I'm going to drink all of it. And it's, you, you know, but like, what? <laughs> very strange. I was very confused. Very, very confused. Mm-hmm. You ordered a 55 gallon barrel of powdered chai. I totally would. <laughs> I know you're joking, but like I totally would. I don't know where I would put that. Maybe in the garage. But chai is my life. I need it. <laughs> I heckin need it. It's delicious. So yeah, that's my chai story. It's not that exciting, but it's just kind of weird. Amazon's strange. <laughs> I am tired from being happy. Well, that's a good reason to be tired. What did you do today? That made it very bright. <laughs> that happened to you with shells, really? You guys remember that meme about the 55 gallon tube of blue that went around a while? No. Is that a real thing? A 55 gallon tube of lube. That would last you so long. Good lord. Where is this fuck? Aha, uh -huh, yeah. I need to find um, the thingy that the I set a trap or something. I just... If it was in your house, I 100% guarantee you would claim claim it as a perch <laughs> you're right <laughs> he totally would because that that's the kind of shit that he does it's true my company uses something similar to that to seal envelopes and keep some of our mailing equipment working a 55 gallon tub of lube what brand of lube <laughs> so when i see the image of it i always flash to the barrel sitting beside the entrance that's hilarious it came with a free pump i'm so uncomfortable <laughs> Well, well, that's fascinating. That's very fascinating. Oh God, that guy is stronger than me by a lot. He's red. <laughs> that's a huge, like I don't, that's a huge compartment of lubricant, lubrication of any kind. See, those guys are okay. I'm not going to be able to- oh god. Who's that guy? I don't want to kill- I don't want to deal with any of these fucks. I just want to kill the main- the main guy. But I don't know where he is. Oh, he's over there. He's in there? Oh, fuck my life. Alright, I'm going to go around. Hi dragon, how are you? If I can ever get a pic of said barrel, I will post it, but no one can see me take it. Oh my god. Oh, this is like a sneaky spy mission. <laughs> you gotta do one of those like... You know, like... Sideways... I learned that you can use the um, down volume button to take a picture on my phone like a week ago <laughs> and I feel like if mine can I bet yours can do something funky too and that will make your spy mission go even smoother <laughs> that's awesome I'm not very sneaky I used to think I was good at being sneaky and then I realized um, that was a lie I wasn't even in the territory yet I might die a few times because I don't um, quite remember oh god how to fight okay I killed one thank you Senu that was that was pretty smooth that was pretty heckin' smooth. My sh- my- my sh- my sword is aflame. 
Where is the guy? Go up! <sighs> this game infuriates me. <laughs> Thank you, Abby. I appreciate you. <laughs> My entire experience with half a spin-off game of Assassin's Creed is basically... I'ma just go around it. Half a spin-off? What was the spin-off? Also, that's a mood. <laughs> I mean, you can die as many times as it takes. That's true. But I hate dying. Ugh. <laughs> are the handholds on the side of the building? I think those are technically handholds. Some of the buildings don't have them, though. Like, it's just this flat brick and you can still climb it, but then, like, on these areas you have to have the handholds. It's fucking weird. This game makes no sense sometimes. Oh, what are the handholds on the side of the building? Wood? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> the French Revolution one with the lady noble assassin. I don't know which one that is. This is the only Assassin's game that I've really been this deep in, except for Valhalla, but I didn't get as far as I am in this one. Don't know which that is. You can still climb it? I remember trying to climb shit and just like sliding back down. Yeah, so, so that's that's what I mean. Some of these like restricted areas, um, so say you're in an area that's not restricted and like you'll find wall that looks just like this but without those pieces of wood jutting out and you can climb it just, just fine but then if you try to climb this without those holds in a restricted area, you slide down the wall. I don't understand what the method is. Welcome back to defend Juno. Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of here. He's a fucking lizard. I, yeah. Like a gecko. A gargoyle gecko to be specific. What level you at an AC now, lady? Um, 33. 33. See? They're there because any structure of any height in Roman architecture required maintenance holds so workers, you know, wouldn't die. I, I mean, you would hope. <laughs> you would heck and hope. That's fair. That's fair. That that makes sense. Oh god, there's a guy right there. No, no. You didn't see me. What are you talking about? <laughs> well. Shit. <laughs> Can I make that jump? Ye yeet! <laughs> oh god, there's a strong boy right there. Uh, yeah, I'm not surprised. I was just talking about it in terms of, um, game stuff. Oh. Shit. <laughs> I know that didn't kill him, but I still got a good hit on him. Shit! Alright. Uh oh! I had to. <laughs> I had to. He was a big boy. Do I have to climb? It looks like I have to climb. Of course I do. Normally they'd attach hemp rope onto them. Oh, that's fascinating. That's pretty cool. That's that's some cool history to learn about. Um Yeah, I was just I noticed um like in certain areas you can't climb the smooth wall, and then in other areas you can't- Oh god! <laughs> so, does anyone have any weekend plans this weekend? <laughs> My eye is itchy. I've overtaken you, probably because I play the game too much. <laughs> I am not surprised, King. 
I only play this twice a week, and I have not played since the 23rd. <laughs> and that is why I obsessively save my supers. Your supers? What do you mean? Trying not to be heck and si Wait, what does that mean? I don't know what that means. Well, that heckin took me all the way back down here. That's unfortunate. Working at the place is my weekend plan. Boo! Don't do it, Abby. It's a trap. It's a trap. I wasn't watching, but it sounded like someone was getting massacred and Lady just talking through the whole murder scene. I mean... <laughs> That, uh, that's usually what happens with me, Uchiha. You know, you know this, you've been here a while. I just talk through all the killings. Mm -hmm. We're doing D&D &D or movie night, but no one in group chat answered me when I asked about it, so I'm tempted to just fail, but that would be bad of me. Part of me wants to be like, man, if you don't want to do it, then don't do it. But then the other part of me is like, I get that because then people get sad. Um, I mean, I, I guess I would try again, and then if no one answers still, I would bail. <laughs> um, hold on, friends. One second. Sorry, give me one second, you guys. I don't think Cobalt and I are doing anything this weekend. Probably just gonna play games. We started Halo 4. That's been really cool. We haven't been playing it a ton, but it's it's been really nice. I'm really sick. Oh no, I got- no, get dragon! Get some rest! Lungs feel like they have bubbling hot Velveeta poured into them. That sounds yucky. I'm sorry. Are you resting? You better heckin' be resting, or I'm gonna call the- the- the brigade. <laughs> the sick brigade. <laughs> They're gonna shove you into a bed and wrap you like a burrito and spoon feed you some heckin chicken noodle soup damn it i was trying to i was trying to sneak attack him and it didn't work fuck it we're going in guns blazing oh you hit hard I hate when it doesn't let me dodge. I clearly pushed dodge and it didn't work. It didn't work. Heckin' rude. I like Velveeta. <laughs> Grew up on it as a cheese source, poured on saltine crackers, except so we had to eat season with That sounds really good, actually. Was that him you were texting? Who? Who? No, I was texting Panna. <laughs> How about no? But yeah, why not? Being wrapped like a burrito sounds pretty heckin' great. You don't wanna be wrapped like a burrito? Better to be comfy. Could use one of those fluffy, um. What am I thinking of? Like a comforter. Ouch! What? Oh my god. Ow! Move! Move, move! Sorry about the camera angle.
think mom would melt the Velveeta and milk and thicken it with the flour water. Th That's fair. Yeah, I, f I feel like that would make it a lot easier to use as a cheese sauce thing for crackers. For sure. There's a guy right there. Come get me, big boy. Oh lord, he on fire. Poison him, please. Thank you. I like that it's blue. How did I... <laughs> Going to urgent care tomorrow because it might be pneumonia and that shit just doesn't go away on set. That's scary. Yeah, take care of yourself, dragon. Do what you gotta do, you know? I'm glad that you're gonna get looked at tomorrow, because that's that sounds like it's really not a good situation to be in. Shit shit. shit fuck <laughs> I can't see what I'm doing. How am I supposed to, it's below me, or in there, how do I get in there though? I read one time in a blog that you should wrap your friends in a blanket like a burrito and feed them sugar if they're heartbroken. That's so cute! I want sugar. <laughs> I want sugar. I'm not heartbroken. I mean, I'm very sad, but not heartbroken. I didn't get my heart broke. <laughs> He's yelling at me. Can I be wrapped up in a burrito with Nelson? Or Nelson can be the burrito and snuggle hug me? I mean, I think the second option sounds better because Nelson's pretty great to snuggle, you know? And the part I object to is being spoon-fed. Why? <laughs> then you don't have to worry about it. <laughs> For why? I would be spoon-fed. Pretty sure Cobalt's actually done that to me before when I've been very sick. Mm -hmm. I don't know if climbing is the... Did I climb up before? I don't... It's not even letting me. It's fucking stupid. Rude. Oh sure, now it works. Yeah, I don't think this is how I get inside. How do I get inside? Find Nelson shaped blanket so I can roll myself up. <laughs> it's leaf. Sh Speaking of Nelson shaped blankets, I've been seeing those on Instagram. They're shaped like a giant leaf, and it seems really cute. I do know it's not COVID. Though. Well, that's good. Cause that would be really bad. Sorry about the wall of text. You're okay. Uh, let me scroll up. We scheduled D&D &D every second and fourth Saturday, but they were tossing out the idea of a movie night this weekend instead and potentially doing it on Friday instead or a different time on Saturday. So like, I always planned for those sets to be there, but like my brain will not let me ask again because I feel annoying. Sorry about the delay. Turtle David came to tell me about stuff I didn't need to know about again. Turtle David. Um, I mean, I don't think anyone would think you're annoying for asking again, because you, like, you're trying to plan shit, and you need to know what's going on, and, you know? I don't think you'd be considered annoying. I get that, though. I get that, though, because I, I get the same way, and then Cobalt's like, I'll just ask them, and I'll be like, no, 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 like, don't do it. There's a hair on my controller. A cat hair, to be specific. I got it. Oh, you tested Nick. Got it. Well, that's good. I had to wrap myself in a blanket and feed myself sugar. No, you Chiha. Who broke your heart, you Chiha? I'll fight them. I'll heck and fight them.
I would sooner be fed with an aspirin tube than be spoon fed when I'm fully capable of doing it myself. I mean, I'm fully capable of doing it myself, but sometimes I don't feel like eating because I'm lazy and I don't want to deal with the chore of eating. So I would accept being spoon fed. Not even like as a, like, similar to a baby. It's just, I don't, like, if I don't feel like eating because I'm lazy, I'm not gonna fucking eat. Because it takes too much energy. <laughs> No one follow how I am, okay? Because I'm really not a good role model. <laughs> do you want to be fed like a baby bird or a dolphin? How do you feed a dolphin? <laughs> Hi, Mamacita. <laughs> Welcome back. Not sure for how long since App is being an ass. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I would say I could maybe check the bit rate, but my bit rate is set to 2,500, which is pretty low. Oh, your coworker is Turtle David. <laughs> he talks and moves so slowly. That's so cute, though. That's so cute, though. Dolphins are jerkwads. <laughs> Dolphins are assholes, man. They'll fucking they'll they're they're mean. They're little shit fuckers. How do I get into this place, y'all? I was like, maybe I just need to go through the door, but. I don't think that's it. Do I have to go underneath? I'm gonna I'm gonna fight this guy as well. Just to get it out of the way. Can I sneak him? <gasps> I snuck attack him. Fuck yeah. Aw man. That that made me sad. I could have killed him in one hit and I did didn't. Shit fuckers, are you saying they fuck shit? No, I'm just using the words. <laughs> I'm just using the words, cause it's fun. All right, I think I've established that I can't get in through this way, so maybe it's below, which means I have to fight more people, which is unfortunate, but that's okay. That looked heckin' entrancey for a second. Playing DVD, love you. No worries, good luck. I, are you killing? I hope it goes well. I love you too. Thanks for being here. Panny is the greatest. <gasps> Shit! <laughs> like, I know it's been a minute, but we, we gotta sync up, my, my guy. Or the sink gonna go too hot. There's a level 37 over there, and you're only level 33. And normally, we could hope for the best, but I don't think that's the case. Okay. Come here. Come here. They hear me. Hello. Why isn't he coming? Oh my god, whatever. Fuck you, guy. How? I'm gonna move. Move, move! I love having this fire sword. It's heckin' cool. I don't know when I'll get to this point, but I do plan on doing the DLCs as well for this game on stream. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do all of the side quests, to be completely honest, because this game is huge and it's it, I'm already like two and a half months in. It's taken forever. <laughs> Look at all the hype! Look at all the hype! No, you! No, you! You! Panna was on the phone with me all day yesterday. It was a lovely distraction. She's amazing. Mm hmm. It's true. It's true. How do I get in this place? I don't get it. Oh, there's windows. Okay. We figured it out, friends. <laughs> Five months? Oh, wait, has it really been that long? Yeah. Yeah, I, I didn't think it had either, really. And then I looked at the Discord um, to see when I posted when I was going to start this game. And I started it on July 22nd. So, <laughs> it's been a while. 
reminded me a bit of the Red Paladin from Game of Thrones. I'm sad because I don't know that reference. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> One day I'll watch it. I have pretty much the entire show on DVD. Is this a cutscene? Why did it go dark? Right? <laughs> oh, my fire sword. Gotcha. It's cool, huh? Shadows by it. I have to. Sorry, <laughs> had to fix my boobs. I have followed your path of murder and madness all the way from my homeland. And now mm -hmm. you will answer for my son's death, Roman. No, Egyptian. What is he holding? Now you will bow before your god. What do? Oh god, my son, my he's friend. a boss fight. Where'd he go? That's not fair. I mean, I do pretty decent damage, so that's nice. Where'd go? I will get back to chat after this fight, okay, friends? Or after this cutscene, at least. Why didn't you kill me when you had the chance in Alexandria? You should have joined the order. Damn it! You need us. But you chose slavery. I swear to God. My son, cowering in another temple. No. Where is he? An annoying fight. No time on this I think he's I taking think. chip chip damage. It won't let me move. Just like all the others. Move, get up! God. There we go. I wanted to at least get another hidden. Like it, friends. I feel like if I keep swinging, then it's okay. <laughs> Ow. I've almost got him. Ow! How is this guy doing this? Bitch. How do I confirm kill? Okay. Thanks for the arrows back. Cutscene? 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 Who was a child? <laughs> my child! Yeah, that's the one thing I do not regret in my life. I will never give you peace! Your son's death made the order bow to me! Caesar, even. I had Rome. It gave me an empire of a thousand sons, each one greater than the last. Ah! Come on! Finish me! You coward! The waste of time! Yeah, I can't do it! I can't! I can't do it! It's 
Forever. Not forever. I will be waiting for you in the field of lilies. <laughs> this relic should never be found again. I must know our son's power has been put to rest. All right, friends. Last of the Magi. Ooh, I got an achievement. Gonna pause while I catch up on chat. Chat, 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 chat. <laughs> Uh, the fire ruined swords. It does, yeah. <laughs> it makes them all brittle and shit. Uh, oh my fucking gods. There is a thing going on right now called Bring Back Louisiana. And it's basically a vaccine initiative since we've been on the top of the listing cases a lot of times. Keep calling me and leaving voicemails that are like, call us back, please. And I'm over here like, leave me alone. I already let them stab me. I don't like phone calls. That's a goddamn mood. <laughs> answer, answer as if you're the Grim Reaper and be like, if you call one more time, I will take your soul. <laughs> boss fight. That boss fight wasn't too bad, though. I can't give myself that much credit. I'm playing on easy. Um, but I, I always get scared of boss fights because in any games, just because like, what, what if I can't do it? Um, it looks like the next part of the main quest is 35 as well, so I think we'll be okay to do it. I'm gonna fast travel out of here because <laughs> that's scary. Where do I need to go? This way. I still have a ton of the map to open up. Um, good god. I just don't know, because this game is really long. Oh, we're going back to Alexandria. Fascinating. I'm gonna go to this one. Well. Hey, Indy, how are you? How have you been? Nelson, you missed it all. I killed Flavius. Flavius. Marvelous. Need to store that number now because I need to do that. Do it, do it. I dare you. I heckin' dare you. I heckin' dare you. Look at Zed's emo. Zed. Zed. Zed Wilder. I love his emotes. He has one of him as a Goron, and it's the best. And I, th I think it's. I think it's his tier 3 sub emote. Fantastic though. Sorry girl, damn thing is messing up for me. It's not letting me watch without it freezing. Hope you have a wonderful stream. That's okay. Thanks for always trying. I really appreciate it. I hope you have a good day. Um, I hope dinner is easy for you so that you can have tasty food but not too much work. <laughs> I'll see you again soon. Mm -hmm. Ow, my wrist popped. It was very ouchy. Let's go talk to my wife. What time is it? I might, um, I might end a little earlier today, like 3.30 my time instead of 4, just because I'm, aside from mental stuff uh physically i'm and haven't been feeling well and today is the same so i don't want to force myself to stream for like a long time you know um, gotta scroll up. i'm good thank you just relaxing all my day off i'll be making nightmare before christmas themed halloween decorations later i hope you're doing well that sounds fun you hand make them all yourself 
Have you made any before? Do you change your theme every year? Or do you always do Nightmare Before Christmas? That's such a good movie. I love that movie. And I'm, I'm okay. I'm not gonna say I'm good or great or well because it's, it's a lie. Um, but I'm okay. <laughs> I'm heckin' here. Playing some Assassin's Creed. It's nice to see you. I hope your decoration stuff goes well. I would love to make holiday decorations, but I'm not very artistic. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Do I need... To... I'm just going to climb the wall because we like to do things the hard way. Gonna go up and over. Oh god, don't stand don't stand in that. You're gonna How? <laughs> I'm a dunce. <laughs> well that's okay. I for some reason I thought she was like in the courtyard. That emo, it's so cute. That's so heckin' cute. Oh, I need to check Animal Crossing today. I've been slowly, ever so slowly, working on my island and um, starting the process of moving buildings to start terraforming, and I'm kind of excited, kind of overwhelmed. <laughs> Levius is dead. I have gone to shit to get our son out of the Duat. Him was at peace. May he walk in the field of reeds. I head to Rome. Mm -hmm. Rome? You still entertain fully? Seriously? I have made mistakes. You have made mistakes. My shirt's causing me uh, problems. Brutus. You waste your energy. Ah. You are the famous Magi. Thanos never ceases to speak of your exploits. I'll get back to chat once this is over. And Cassius, our Roman brothers. We're going to cut these bastards down from across the seas. To Timios and Caesar. Haven't I already been with them before? Does Cleopatra still rule? There is no ruler in Egypt, plunged into the will of various tyrants. Our queen has abandoned us for Rome. Nothing has changed here. Memphis is overrun by the Order. Aya, we need you. Well... Nothing but betrayal. The heckin' ball! I cannot end it like this. I, uh, that cut. Shit. Mouth spear should stay hidden forever. Cause so much pain. <laughs> um, do, 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 do. I keep to that theme since I've been making more decos. I already have the bats of Oogie Boogie and some of his door which all glow with a black light that's so cool i will be painting three pumpkins with the faces of jack sally and oogie boogie tonight that's so cute i love that i love that do you make decorations for outside as well or like just the inside of your house you gotta drive no worries uh if you're still here i'll pop back in no worries thanks for being here it's always nice to see you i hope your drive goes well and that you get home safely but quickly <laughs> and I'll see you later I'm just gonna keep going till I feel done I guess <laughs> actually well I gotta go speak to my wife she's 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 being cray wait where do I need to speak to her outside as well nice that's really cool do you do that kind of stuff for all the holidays or just Halloween I'm really bad at, I don't ever decorate for holidays and it's not like I don't enjoy the holidays or anything really, but I just am lazy and I don't know, <laughs> don't celebrate much to be honest. I don't want to run all that way. That way? I'm gonna, I'm gonna fast travel to this thing. 
Must be making zeros. Ow! Gravestone out of carving styrofoam. Ooh, that's gonna be cool. Are you gonna, um... Ow! Are you gonna make zero as well, like, to hover over the gravestone? Mostly Halloween and Christmas, gotcha. I mean, <laughs> I feel like those are definitely the two most popular to decorate for. That's fair. If I were, like, a super die-hard Nightmare Before Christmas fan, <laughs> I'm literally going the same distance, whatever. Um, I think that I would make uh, Nightmare Before Christmas themed stuff for all of the holidays that show up in that little circle of trees, like Easter and stuff, like decorate the Easter eggs with their faces and shit. I think that would be cool. That'd be heckin' cool. Remember this place? Yeet! I need to be quick and sneaky about getting out of here. No! How? Fine, I'll bite. Oh my god. He's only level 8. Fuck you, guy! I'm gonna... I'm gonna go. <laughs> God damn it! That's exactly what I'm talking about. Some areas that have smooth walls, you can't climb it. And it's usually, I noticed, the restricted areas. My nose itches so bad. Are they chasing me? He said, nah, fuck that guy. Thanks, Senu. They're firing arrows at me. Well, I already have zero but got him from a store. He's too cute to mess up with my lackluster sewing skills. That's fair. <laughs> That's fair. I get that. I can't sew. That's cool though that you already have one to use. You don't. That's like one less thing you have to worry about making. That's heckin' cool. Do you make your own, um... Do you ever have a Christmas tree? Like, do you make your own Christmas tree ornaments and stuff, too? I've never heckin' done that, either. I'm so excited to have a Christmas tree. Cobalt and I, for years, we... In our entire time together, we've only had two trees. Um, one in the first apartment and one in the other apartment. And I'm excited, because now we have a house, and so I'm excited to, like you know, walk out and have a tree and, like, have our, our little presents to each other underneath it with, like, the little lights and stuff. I'm so excited. I don't even celebrate shit, and I'm excited. <laughs> Heckin' yeah. All right, friends, I'm going to talk to my wife, um, and then I will get back to stuff. <gasps> That's beautiful. Screenshot, please. Thanks. <laughs> our victories have multiplied. Our bond not so. Right? We could never have been. Everything has told us our love is impossible. You're right. <laughs> Something bigger has called us. I just got it's water all over my face. Only now we are letting go. Well, let the gods decide. The gods are dead. Why is she acting like this? That's also a really good screenshot. Sorry, friends. Must sacrifice our personal lives for the greater good. Why can't I connect All to this the server? Was for a reason. I was wrong to be so reckless in public without killing. We must work in the shadows. No. Don't want Egypt to. Has fallen. Greece also. And Rome will fall too. All will fall to the creed, yet no one will know. When we assassinate. We assassinate only those who deserve it. The few sick souls who try to control us. But they will never know who we are. Cold, calculated, poets of the kill. I am fine with this. I am not a father anymore. 
I am not a husband. I am not a Medjay. I am a hidden one. Yes. We are the hidden ones. We sharpen our blades. Pull what hope is left from this foul earth. Good Bayek of Siwa. What are you of now? A new creed. Ours is finished. That's interesting. <laughs> I was not anticipating that being how the logo was formed. Wow, wow. Look at that. Wow. Hmm. Was that the end of the main quest line? If so, I guess that does mean that I have a bunch of side quests I need to do, because I gotta level up. Am I able to pause? Nope. <laughs> Bitch and stitches? <laughs> what? So I'm so sorry, friends. G give me one more moment. Those don't need to be your last words. Who the fuck are you? Does the name William Miles ring a bell? Assassin? Then you know who I am. We, the assassins, have been watching you. It's unusual for an Abstergo employee to take an interest in a country's revolution. You're not wrong there. We know about your work with the Animus. Astounding what you and Deanna were up to. Indeed. They played you, didn't they? Sophia Ricken made you so many promises. Enough! We're not talking about her. Sure. Plenty of other subjects to cover on our ride to Alexandria. Don't assume I'm going anywhere with you. Well, let's look at your options. You can come with me, or you can stay here and do the dance of death again and again until you make a mistake. They only need you to make one. There's no going back to your old life, Layla. I never planned to. But you'd finally be able to work on the Animus project, our version of it. And with us, you'd always have the freedom to do things your way. Fine. Let's do this. Baby. That doesn't mean I'm on your side. Good enough. Alright, let me get back to chat. Oscar, hi! Hello, here to lurk while I do some washing up. No worries, thanks for lurking. Thanks for being here. I appreciate you a ton. I hope you're having a good day. Um, sorry for the late response. I was watching the cutscenes. I don't make any ornaments, but I received a lot of Christmas deco from my mother. What I do for Christmas are streamers and snowflakes made from construction paper with my daughters. Then hang them up from the ceiling. I also bake a lot of goodies. That sounds so comfy. <laughs> that sounds so comfy. The baking part especially. I, I don't even bake. Like, I don't know how to bake well. But, um... I think that part would be the funnest. I had the hiccups. That's heckin' cool. That's super cool. Do you guys make like, sorry, I have the hiccups, um, gingerbread cookies and stuff? I made a giant gingerbread cookie one time. It wasn't from scratch, it was like a box mix, but um, I made a giant one one time. It was in the shape of a heart. And it was, I made it for Cobalt because we were fighting about something and I wanted to apologize to him and so I made it while he was gone and uh, left it out to cool off and such for him to come home to and be like, oh, 
<laughs> that was many years ago. Um, so, I know I should read all this stuff, but I'm not going to. I'll, I'm probably going to read everything on my own time, or like another time I play through it or something. Um, because it's a lot. There, there's a lot to read on stream, and I don't want to. Make a gingerbread house if you want to do a castle. A castle? You can make, um, Lady Dimitrisk's castle. Hi, Savaloy! Read me a story. What kind of story do you want? Where do you want it from? How are you? Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. Hampkin, read me a story. Story. Uh, yeah, you should make Lady Dimitri's castle. That would be dope. Out of gingerbread? Which that's probably going to be really hard. But I, I think I think you can do it. We also make lots of different cookies and mini pies like apple, pecan, and pumpkin. Ooh, tasty! I'd be down for some pumpkin pie. Would you mind reading me and Nelson a story? Not at all! Where would you and Nelson like the story to come from? I've got Kindle and I've got five bookshelves. <laughs> I'm sweaty. I spelled Nelson wrong. That's how badly we want any story. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. Um, any story. I'll look through my Kindle. <laughs> we'll look through Kindle today. How about that? Let's see. Nelson is the bestest bean. Ben's the bestest bean. Oh, you want it from a shelf. That's totally fine. Heck yeah. Let me go get it from a shelf. I'm gonna switch to the Be Right Back screen for this, because I feel like it. <laughs> I will be right back, okay? Hello, hello CFC, Fan Grant. <laughs> Welcome in, how's it going? From the fourth bookshelf in the Kindle? I don't know if that's a thing, Savaloy. I don't have bookshelves on the Kindle, just in my living room. <laughs> the one I found in my living room was this one. The 13 Gates of the Necronomicon. I have a lot of Donald Tyson stuff, don't at me. Thank you, dragon! Thank you! As it's empty, I drank it. Thanks. You're the best. You're the best. Oh. Savaloy, is this okay? Wow, look how clearly the camera's picking that up today. Fuck yeah. A workbook of magic. I'm great. Turns out my fiance is pregnant. That's cute! Congratulations! Aw, congrats, congrats. Are you excited? Is she excited? That's a trip. Do y'all have kids already? This okay? Okay. Gonna flip to a random page. Sorry, there's no music. It's perfect? Fuck yeah. I thought so too. Gonna flip right there. Whoa, that's a long page. Sorry, I hit the mic with the book. Um... 
<laughs> my hair was in the book and it was pulling it. We are excited and no, we don't. Well, that's cool. I'm excited for you. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, friend. Be right back. No worries. I'm going to start story time. I'm going to read. It's page 58 of The 13 Gates of the Necronomicon by Donald Tyson. Um, this is under... I'm trying to move my chair. This is under Second Gate Unique Personalities is what the chapter is called. In order to find a way to return to a wonderful dream city that he had once known, but had forgotten how to reach, Carter undertook a convoluted quest of several months' travel to the lofty and mystical mountain Kadath, which lies in the cold wastes, so that he could consult the gods of the earth who dwell on its summit. It transpired that the gods themselves had stolen Carter's city for their own to play in. So much did they love it. Carter took back his city and returned to the waking world the same night he had left it, for in the dreamland's dream lands time does not pass at the same rate it passes in waking life. In the final story that directly involves Randolph Carter through the gates of the Silver Key, we learn what happened to Carter when at age 54 he took his Silver Key and vanished into a grove of elms near ruins of the old Carter family farm. The tale is set in the New Orleans house of Carter's literary and financial executor, Etienne Laurent de Marini. I don't know if I said that right. Uh, who is described as this continent's greatest mystic, mathematician, and orientalist, and takes place four years after Carter's disappearance. Friends of Carter have gathered to preside over the division of his estate among his distant cousins, who are represented by one of their number, Ernest K. Aspinwall of Chicago. These names are pretty, pretty heckin' grand. Well. In addition to the executor and the cousin, there is present Carter's friend, Ward Phillips, a mystic of Providence, Rhode Island, who is none other than Lovecraft himself under another name. He was described as lean, gray, long-nosed, clean-shaven, and stoop-shouldered. <laughs> well, he declared his conviction that since his disappearance, Carter had ruled in the dreamlands as king of the town of Elikvad. I don't know if I'm saying any of these right, please forgive me. The executor de Marini also believed Carter to still be alive, but the cousins had forced the division of his estate by applying legal pressure. The final man present in the mansion is a mysterious turban figure who represents himself as Swami Chandraputra, an adept from Benares, India, who claims to have information concerning the fate of Randolph Carter. I'm so sorry for the mis- my goodness. I'm just going to say this like a white girl. <laughs> Chandra Put Putra relates to the others that Carter conducted a ritual with the key while standing under the elms at twilight four years ago, involving nine turnings of the key accompanied by incantations. This carried him back to his boyhood when he was only nine years old. The next day, the nine-year-old Carter entered the snake den with the key and, in the inner chamber of the cave, used the key again before a natural arch surmounted with a curious featuring feature resembling a carved hand. This time, the key opened a gate to an extension of the earth that lies outside of time. Carter confronted the guardian of the gate, a being known as Umir Atwil, the most ancient one called by Alhazred in the Necronomicon, the prolonged of life. Concerning this guide, Alhazred wrote, they would have been more prudent had they avoided commerce with him. The most ancient one resembled a human form, but was half again as tall as a man, and shrouded entirely in a neutral colored fabric in which there appeared to be no eye holes through which he could see. He offered to show Carter the ultimate gate, and Carter accepted him as a guide. And that's the end of that. That was 58. Um, it continued on to 59. It is what it is. Uh, of 13 Gates of the Necronomicon by Donald Tyson. These books... I love these books. I just think they're really neat. <laughs> I can't pronounce like two thirds of what the fuck they're saying, but I love them. Yay! So that's what it looks like. I will take a picture to post on Discord for you guys. But yeah. I, I'm glad that my finger landed on this because I was like, that's so fitting. Because I also have the Necronomicon sitting right here. <laughs> Thank you for the story time, Sir Savaloy. You're the heckin' bestest. 
You're the heckin' bestest. I hope you're doing well. I saw your um, Twitter post about Biomutant. You excited? You don't have to talk if you don't want to. I understand. I understand. <sighs> we gonna get back in the Aminus? Aminus. <laughs> Here we go. Yes. I'll just read shit at some point in my own time. I'm gonna play for like another 15 minutes or so and then find someone to raid so that I can go clean up my kitchen and then go lay down. I'm very tired, very sleepy, and my back hurts. <laughs> I'm glad we got that section of the quest line done, though. I, f I feel like that that alone was progress. Is that for Foxidas? A gift? No. It's a relic. I don't want to talk about it, Demastis. Isn't that Bayex? Let me have it. I'll give it to Foxidas myself. He loves this. She thing. said no, bitch. I'm in no mood for compromise today. I, I don't I don't blame her. <laughs> I really don't. That would piss me off. Hi Rick James, how That's are you? Crack morning. A strong wind, you'll be standing in Rome's forum in uh, two days' time. Two? It's over between you and Bayek, eh? I can feel no decision is easy. You are a chosen one. And now you are free! <laughs> like me! Don't so hit on her. Day. I'm like, I, I feel like he's gonna try and I don't trust it. I don't understand. They could- wow. They could have just stayed together. I don't get it. I'm mad. Don't forget to take your melatonin and help you get the rest when you sleep. Nod. <laughs> I don't have any melatonin. Sad face. How do I sail again? There we go. <laughs> melatonin is a really good idea though. I'm, pro I'm probably not going to sleep. I usually don't, to be honest. Even when I'm really tired. I tend to just lay down and lay there. Roman fleet up ahead. Do you see? Don't drop your guard entirely. We should assume they are expecting us. I don't want to fight more boats. I don't like fighting the boats. Eager to be done with this scum. I don't on to the next pile of scum. I don't like fighting the boats. Such is the world we live in. I'm letting the little bar on the bottom charge up because it was heckin' empty. We have been spotted! Those flares will summon their navy. Prepare Gummies focus on us melatonin gummies. They definitely been helping me. That sounds awesome. That's that's nice of them. Hi Welder! Thanks for the raid. How was your stream today? Hello everyone! Welcome in, welcome in. Bread, 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 bread. <laughs> How are you? What did you play today? Destiny? Heck yeah. How was Destiny? If anyone's new here, hi, I'm Lady of the Wood. I stream adventure games, RPGs. Um, I'm probably going to go back to life simulators fairly soon. Um, just like to chill. I'm much more mellow today than normal. I was pretty heckin' sassy earlier, but now I'm just tired. Uh, but I'm glad to have you all here. I hope you're having a lovely day. And and thanks for coming with the raid. It's really nice to meet you all. And gift raid. Stream was good. Destiny was hair pulling hard, but fun. I bet. I bet. <laughs> do you play with other people, like friends and stuff, or do you just like hang out, play by yourself, play solo? 
I've seen a little bit of Destiny 2 because Cobalt tried it for a little while at some point and it seemed kind of cool. It just kind of reminded me of Halo, but with like more space stuff than normal, which is weird to say. I, I don't know how else to explain it better than that, to be honest. Oh, you had two other in your team. Nice, nice. That's cool. That's cool. Do they stream as well? Have you been- didn't you used to play Minecraft? Have you been playing any Minecraft recently? Whoa. My camera. Those guys? Why didn't it fire? I don't know what I'm doing. How do I? I don't know what I'm doing, so I'm just gonna ram him. Alright, I got one guy. Give me one second, y'all. While I, uh... Attempt to fight some asshole shippies. How do I? Oh, that's how I fire it. I couldn't remember. Is that a? Gonna go. You're gonna lurk. No worries. Thanks for the raid. Get get your food. I hope it's delicious. I hope it's delicious. You're the heckin' best. You're the heckin' best. I'm hungry too. I had lunch, but it's a, uh, you know. I'm not trying to attack allied ships. What allied ship did I attack? Whoops. There's a hair in my eye. Hi, Dragon. Welcome back. Are you feeling any better? More? I don't do well with this ship Our stuff, y'all. They'll hit us. We are overwhelmed. These hell ships are too many. We must sink them before they reach us. They're too much if they strike us. Take them down. How do I do that? Fire ships front. Oh, they're little babies. Got it. Where? Where? Oh shit, okay. Uh oh. Hold to brace? If I'm- I'm not trying to ignore chat y'all, I'm sorry. I'm- I'm not very good with the um... The stuff with the ships. So I'm trying to get this done. Why didn't it? Shit. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Crap. I need to get that one down first. Okay. Hold on, I'll, I'm gonna pause so I can scroll up a little bit. They don't stream, I haven't played any Minecraft recently, I do need to. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I see. Playing a fun 2D Souls-like game. Which, which game is that? Not feeling better, had to get up to use the restroom, now my chest is pounding, if only this was Sea of Thieves. Oh, I'd, I would never play Sea of Thieves because I know for a fact that that's just playing with other people and I really don't like to play with people. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not, um... 
with our fleet dispersed and our allies gone, we're undone! Man up your own salt lick! Save your bloody ship! I'm not great with, um... This heckin' battleship stuff. I'm trying. Oh god. Shit. I can see the weak points. I need to shoot at those weak points. Here we go. Come on. There we go. You must write your memoirs one day. I may just do. And if you promise to sneak one copy into the library, I'll let you live on. Surely this chapter will be the most widely read of all. I need to blow shit. Crap. <laughs> Fire! No! There's no more weak spot to hit. Because I failed. No! There we go. Alright. Is there more? Okay, I think we I think I think we did it. <laughs> Words are hard. <laughs> Words are hard. Something's unsettling about this. So am I gonna play as Aya for a little while? I guess that'll be for tomorrow. Also, I'm just shaking all over. You're shaking all over? Do you have any medicine? Do you have a fever? It's called Salt and Sanctuary. Oh, I've never heard of that before. Is it on your your Switch? You were you were telling me about you have the Switch, right? Because you're playing Bioshock handheld. I think that's what we were talking about. I have a really bad memory. I have a very bad memory. Larry looks so cute. He always looks cute. Don't get me wrong. He always looks heckin' cute. By the way, um. I didn't mean to have this little cat instead of Theodore sitting on the mushroom, but he looks cute as hell. I'm just gonna pretend it's Larry in my stream. People love you, Caesar. You're a god. Fuck that guy. The Senate will not bow so easily. That parliament of clucking heads. Let me be your wolf. That's a big boy. <laughs> Go. Do nothing until I get this in. I don't know if I should attempt to play this part or if I should save it for tomorrow. I don't actually know if I'm gonna have a choice. Her knives are shaped weird. That one in particular in her right hand. Oh god. Boss fight? Boss fight? Boss fight? Boss fight? Boss fight? So Caesar is the king of the order now. Caesar is the father Oh, of his the weapons are cool. You and Caesar will die. You are meddling with the affairs of the order. Holy the god. Order is greater than Rome. Go back to the, and the rest of the liars and slaves. <laughs> You make me understand why murder is just. Get him, Aya. Yes. I, I control greatness. I will erase your order from the hands. Kneel to Caesar. Kneel to Rome. Oh, God. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. We are the writers of history. Caesar will follow you to oblivion. Your son Ow. himself when he saw the knife. How is he freezing me like that? You have no honor. You stole everything from me. Got I am a Gabiniani. I thought you would scurry away, little one. You should have taken your chance to 
drop off the map. Flavius isn't here to save you this time, Septimius. No Roman deals will be made. I really want his weapons. That shit's fucking cool. Move, Aya. My son's hut for your life was revenge everything you hoped i will get back to chat once this is done sweat tonight <laughs> this fucking kill off with the order i served them and your beloved egypt and i'll be rewarded in the afterlife an eternity Drinking and whoring with my brothers. The only thing that waits for you is oblivion. For your name, your order, and the rotting corpses of your cabinyani. That was to devour your fetid heart. That was really cool. Dope, dog. With the rest of the Senate. All right. Um, I'm going to leave it there, and can, we'll continue this tomorrow. Cause I am tired and I want to go lay down. <laughs> I'm gonna catch up on stuff first. I do not have medication, not for that. To, to, it sounds like you have a fever. Tylenol's good at breaking fevers. I figured you updated your Kathamon for spoopy season. Uh, not initially. <laughs> That's part of why I left it. Um, it was a complete a accident. Because when all that Twitch stuff went down, um, all the things like Kathamon and sound alerts and stuff were like, you have to re-input your URLs, blah, blah, blah. So I did that with Kathamon. And um, I guess at some point I activated the little kitty and I didn't realize it until today <laughs> when I turned the stream on. So I'm just pretending that Larry's here in our stream because look at him, he's cute. There also used to be a little ghost that I had added in, but it kept freezing. Like it's supposed to just float across the screen, but it kept freezing in place for no fucking reason. So I just got rid of it. <laughs> I just got rid of it. I need to see my doctor because it's complication with my genetic disorder. And yes, it is on my Switch, but also for Steam and the whole... Oh, gotcha. I gotcha. That sounds like another appointment that has to be made, friend. That's cool that that game is on all the platforms. A... Kukri? Kukri? The knife she was using? <laughs> pillow fight. <laughs> no pillow fight. Not a fever. Neuro... Oh, I can't read that word. Heckin' imbalance, gotcha. Neurotransmitters are important, yeah. <laughs> yeesh, yeesh. <laughs> I agree. I agree. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna find someone to rip. Well, Dragon, I hope you start feeling better soon. I know um, with chronic illness, you know, it's not a thing of like, We'll feel better eventually. It's it's like I I feel a little bit better than I did yesterday kind of situation, but I'm gonna switch scenes. Let me know if it gets louder when I switch. It feels like it got louder. Am I wrong? Yeah, it seems kinda loud. I'm gonna turn it down a smidgen. Is that better? Much louder. Sorry. I, I tried fixing the fucking audio shit in my scenes um, to, to get rid of that issue and I apparently still haven't fixed it. I'm sorry about that. It always- I know, I, I tried to fix it though. 
I hadn't tried to fix it though. Hadn't had a chance to test it. Oscar! Welcome back. I'm actually gonna find someone to raid because I'm very tired. I wanna go. I can lay down. Otter's got. Oh, Flame is on. I should raid Flame. I don't ever get to raid Flame. I might just do that because <laughs> he's great. Tell that to my genetic disorder. Yeah. I'm sorry. You should sleep. Sleep is great. Sleep is heckin' great. Raid! <laughs> I'm gonna be raiding, um, Flame. He's great. I think most of you have been in his channel already. But if not, uh, he's fantastic. He's really nice. Um, and he's playing Hades right now. And, uh, his, his title... His title says, I will brush my teeth and then drink orange juice if I don't beat Hades today. <laughs> so, you know. There's that. So I'm gonna set up the raid. Uh, for some reason I was having trouble writing his name in there. Thank you, Abby. <laughs> I appreciate you. I appreciate you. If y'all have subs, feel free to use that sub message. I'm going to copy it as well. Um, I'm so fucking out of it right now. I thank you all for hanging out with me today. You're the bestest. Um, I will see you all tomorrow for some more Assassin's Creed. I don't exactly have specific plans tomorrow. Jesus Christ. Um, I just know that I'm going to continue the main quest until I can't, so... But I will see you all tomorrow. I hope you have a lovely night. Please give Flame some love. And 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 um, there's a follower message. If you would like to copy it. Thank you, Abby. You're so amazing. I appreciate you. Bye, everyone. See you tomorrow.